all my 20 odd years of dating, this was the worst one that I ever dated. So well, I guarantee if you knew this human, you would have done the same. There's a chick in Sydney who has posted, you know, that air tasker website. Yeah. yeah I've used it a few times mm-hmm. because, um, for Valentine's day, she put up on air tasker that she'd give someone $350 if they could come and help her tail her boyfriend because she thought he was cheating on her. <laughs> so she just needed like someone to help her with her reconnaissance miss- mission. Right. And I'm kind of confused as to why she's asking for $350. Like why would she pay that? Because I do something like that for nothing. <laughs> you, you, knowing you like I do, yeah, you probably would. You, you somehow uh, and for some reason really enjoy uh, the idea of catching out people that are doing the wrong thing, especially exposing j- dirty lying in, scumbags in relationships. Is, is that because you know you've had some bad experiences in the past? Yes, and you sort of want to, you know, you could have your own like cheaters TV show here in the Illawarra. I just want to help out of the ladies who have been through similar situations. Busted my ex when I was twenty. Right. I just I stayed down at his nana's house. Mm. I knew he was cheating on me. Yes. And I called him. Yeah. And I watched him from the window, and he told me that he was out with one of his mates, but really I'd set it up with the other girl for him to come back to his house yes, so that he could pick her up and take her on a date. So the other girl was in on it as well. Yeah. So you'd spoken to her and said, hey, yep. I don't know whether you know this, but he's two-timing you yep. with me and vice versa. And then so his mum and his nana and I sat at nana's house. Wow. <laughs> While he was walking down the street on the phone to me going, hey, babe, yeah, I'm just going out with Brett tonight. And I'm like, oh, no worries. It's fine. I'll, um, I'll have a great night. I'll talk to you tomorrow. And then I snuck into his house because his nana lived next door to the house and I snuck in. And Hang on. Did you sneak in or did you have help from nan and the mum as well? Well, the mum opened the house up for me so the, the, while so he was all... in there having a shower and I kind of like snuck in, sat on his bed waiting for him. He was like, what are you doing here? I was like, surprise. So hang on. They're all in on it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's very clear you have plenty of experience. <laughs> so if anyone is uh, interested or looking for some help on the stakeout mission, here's your girl, Linda Rogers. Hit me up in the DMs. <laughs>